Well, today is a very special day. Today, my niece, Emma, graduates from high school, and I made her this book. I don't get to be there, but I made her this book. I even made the little tassel, and these are little embellishments I got, recollections at Michael's. The book is a Heidi Swap um, cinch book, and I have the cinch machine, so I binded it together, and this is the first page, and it's really kind of cool because my friend that I scrapbook with every Monday, Carolyn, um, I'm always telling her not to throw anything away, and she was helping a friend, <laughs> and they came across, this is a um, picture frame, like it would hold a 5 by 7 and she brought me a whole stack of them yesterday. And so I used it inside. And so this is a place for them to put a picture of Emma. Um, the flowers are punched as well as, um, let's see, these are, oh man, they're, they're from Michael's from a few years ago from the bridal section. And then of course I, I use sequins, um, make it sparkly. And then there's some more little, of the recollections. Um, it was, I call it party glitter, uh, confetti. So this page just has a golden sticker for her to put whatever. Um, memories from her senior year. Uh, here's a little envelope with a couple of things, of things to do. A uh, little paper and then I love life. And this is actually from the packaging for the die cuts. I don't throw nothing away. But I try to use it right away. Um, her school colors are actually bl are blue. and um, But I really like this green paper that said memories. And so I took it and made that part of the theme for the be uh, before graduation. Uh, this is says love, beautiful moments. Remember, treasure, remember this, love is friendship and music. Um, I know that my niece had an adopt-a-grandparent type program in her school that she loved very much. Um, also, she got her driver's license, so I have these stickers. I thought it was appropriate. Here's a place that she can write something about it, put other things in. And then I have this little key. Um, so I put it in here. Um, here's another. This one is just some of that recollections I call it party glitter um, on a paper clip hanging on. And just a place for more pictures. Not totally um, graduation related here, so it could be pictures from her senior year. Um, there's a page insert here to put a few more pictures. This one says simply the best. Um, this one again just with stars and a little flag. This is the inside of a photo box. If you don't use them, um, you might have a stack of them somewhere. And so I stamped the date of her graduation and I used a little of the star washi tape here. And I made, it's Tuesday, so I made a paper clip for Tuesday. She can put something in here. Um, and this is some more of that little party glitter. It says 2016. And then I just stamped the back of that. There's a place for more pictures. A little pocket to put something in. Um, this is kind of a party page, so maybe something about one of her parties or something that she went to. Um, here we have graduation, the gown. Again, some more of the flowers and a gold seal. It looks very uh, studious. Um, this one is actually a pocket page. And so there's the you and me, a place to write on the back. Um, class of 2016, again with the, the star washi tape. And it's just um, grid on the back. So down here, um, some more of the flowers. Here is a, actually it's the cap that goes with that gown. <laughs> and I stapled in 2016 because since it was a pocket page, I could do that. Over here, 
it just says congratulations graduate um, and this has uh, was another a page from another book that I had so I wanted to use it um, and this was another page and so place for her to write remember this moment I left the flap so the picture can go in there um, have the diploma this is some older stickers that I have you'll see them throughout and this is probably my favorite page again I left room the picture can go here there's more pictures can go on these cards you can write on those cards it was very last minute I still had this diploma left so I put it here um, and as you can see little cinch mistake I accidentally <laughs> put holes on both sides um, but that's okay uh, my niece wrote a poem it was <laughs> absolutely beautiful and it's in the front of her yearbook and so I left this page or I made this page thinking that she could probably put that there and then write the story about it here again more of the punch flowers some of the recollection stars um, this is for family and I left it a little more plain because it was I added it at the end so this is <laughs> this is the other side of that frame from in the front probably archival safe because it was meant to hold pictures so here's another page and we have the little paper clip with the grad and the I love the class of 2016 washi tape I did buy it specifically for this but figuring that I can cut 2016 off of the washi tape and use it in a lot of things um, for the rest of the year so here is another just a bunch of of things I had a congratulate or congrats sticker in my stash um, I know that there is a picture of the class all in their caps and gowns and I got a copy of that would be a, be really cute on here um, this one says hats off class of 2016 would be cute to have a picture of you know if they throw their hats <laughs> okay and then I made a, a pocket oh look at that so lots of fun stuff and then there's room for another picture in there and here's another page and the last big page is the future is mine and I thought that was appropriate we have a things to do pad also I think appropriate when you're graduating and I <laughs> I stuck a little paper airplane in here and says we are ready to watch you soar um, I just thought that she'd get a kick out of that and then there's my note to her I have one last little remember um, friends names places whatever I just thought it would be kind of neat so that is my graduation album I made it in less than a day um, and I like this I think that'll be really cute hanging off um, and she'll know which one it is so happy graduation Emma